Good evening, I'm Jacqueline Matter. I'm Scott Dennis. Thanks so much for being with us tonight. Topping our news tonight, an African-American family came to Sarasota for a relaxing vacation. Instead, family members say they returned to their upscale hotel room to find a racist note. They spoke exclusively with ABC 7's Dwayne Lindo. He joins us now live with the details of their experience. Dwayne. Well, Jacqueline Scott, the family claims it's a case of vacationing while black at Art Ovation Hotel on North Palm in downtown Sarasota, a hotel that just opened up earlier this year, marketing itself as Sarasota's signature Hotel of the Arts. They also have a rooftop bar that has been pretty popular as of late, but now accused by one family of dropping the ball when it comes to hospitality. This is, this is something, you know, in 2018, you, you don't expect this kind of thing to happen. While staying at the Art Ovation Hotel in downtown Sarasota, Frank Davis says he and his family left the room to have breakfast and go shopping. When they returned, noticed a note placed inside a lamp next to the bed. And I went and looked at the, the lamp and looked at the note and was shocked. The note says, you're a Davis says it's the first time he's experienced racism like this since the 1960s. His family took immediate action and confronted the general manager and even called Sarasota police who filed this report. But Davis says they took no action. They basically touted that it was a free speech incident and not a, a formal criminal matter. The hotel offered a free night stay according to Davis, but his family declined, saying they no longer felt safe staying there. Uh, who knows what other kind of actions that individual who clearly knew that we were there was capable of, which is why we decided to relocate to a uh, uh, and find additional new lodging for the rest of our stay. Davis says he believes whoever did this had access to the room. That is either the hotel staff or somebody who bamboozled the hotel staff into letting them have access to my room for some unknown reason. And while the incident has left a bad taste in Davis's mouth, he says his family will still vacation in Sarasota as they have for years. We need to promote a better tomorrow by holding ourselves accountable to a higher standard. And clearly whoever wrote that note did not hold themselves accountable to a higher standard. Now, late this afternoon, the hotel sent us this statement about the incident. We apologize for the guests' experience. We remain committed to providing an environment where all feel welcome. Allegations such as this are very concerning to us. The matter is being actively investigated, and appropriate actions will be taken based on the findings. Hotel leadership has engaged with the guest, and we have extended our apologies. In addition, the hotel will be reinforcing its sensitivity training with a associates at all levels. Our corporate team has contacted the guest and apologize as well. Reporting live in Sarasota, Dwayne Lindo, your Suncoast News.